Hi, I'm Kelvin Adams with the SoFast Junior Operator Program. Today, I'm going to go over the basic four rules of weapon safety. Number one, treat every weapon as if it is loaded. Number two, keep your finger outside the trigger well unless actively engaging your target. Number three, never point your weapon at anything you are not willing to destroy. And number four, know where your target is, what's in line with it, what's behind it. Never shoot at anything not positively identified. Hi, I'm Jeff Adams, and in addition to our junior operators demonstration of the four basic rules of weapon safety, there are other considerations I want you to keep in mind. And number one, personnel that have been determined intoxicated by alcohol or illicit drugs will not be allowed on the range or in your firearms. Number two, personnel that are taking prescription medication or medication that may impair judgment must notify the range safeties to make a determination by the shooter's participation or observation of training. As previously stated, weapons will be handled as if they are loaded and other condition of your weapon at all times loaded or unloaded. During employment of the AR or M4, the finger is kept outside the trigger well and the weapon is on safe unless the shooter is actively engaging the target. Upon completion of the engagement, the safety selector switch is rotated back to the safe position and the finger is removed from the trigger well. During employment of the pistol, if you have a Beretta, the weapon is off safe but decocked with the finger outside the trigger well unless you are actively engaging the target. Upon completion of that engagement, your safety decocking lever will rotate from the safe position back to the fire position prior to holstering. Ballistic certified or military law enforcement issued eye protection should be worn at all times. Hearing protection should be worn at all times. Your medevac platform should be located in an easily accessible area. You should have a strip mat to the nearest medical facility in case of injury during your training. Identify your medic, your medical personnel, the location of your medical aid bag, and your medic is not responsible for driving the route or knowing the route. You will identify the driver so that the medic can provide the necessary first aid in order to provide proper treatment. And lastly, most importantly, everyone is a range safety officer. Anyone can declare a ceasefire when an unsafe act or unsafe condition exists. Thank you.